Hello everyone. This is something very different that I've never done before. I don't usually do vlogs on my channel, but I thought this would be fun. I am sitting outside waiting for them to open my favorite used bookstore. Um, it is called Poppers and it's an indie used bookstore. Love it so much. So I'm taking you guys book shopping with me and we are going to look for some children's Christmas books. That is the goal. We'll see what I find. I will share my plan with you at the end because this is very much a um, intentional new Christmas um, ritual that I am starting with my family this year. So I wanna share that with you and share what I find. So let's go book shopping. So a new tradition is gonna be happening in our household this year. A friend shared with me that she brings out her basket of Christmas children's books December 1st and they one by one unwrap a book and read it before bed leading up until Christmas. Got a couple winners. Can't wait to show you guys. Okay, so you guys know I went in specifically looking for Christmas children's books and I found four. I actually found more, but I realize it's hard when you're like looking for children's books because I don't wanna just get something that's not in my definition like good and I'm not saying that there are books that are not good but I wanted some with meaning and, and like depth and um, a lot of the Christmas ones I found didn't really have that um, so I found four and so I wanted to show you guys the four that I found if you're interested when I decide so I'm gonna wrap each one for December and we will open one a night um, starting December 1st. So if you guys are interested in seeing the entire collection that I'm gonna wrap, I will show that to you because I currently, I counted my books before I left. I currently have five Christmas favorite children's books that my kids, well, some of them my kids have grown up with. Some of them I've acquired since they were adults like Elf on the Shelf because I'm that mom who had, who like, I put the elf in very questionable situations, but my kids are older, so it's okay. Anyhow, I found four books, and so that puts me needing, let's see, how many did I say I have? Five, one, two, I had them sitting out. I have nine total, I believe, I believe. So yeah, I still need a good bit more, but Hopefully I'll find them. There is another bookstore that I adore, so I will probably hit that sometime this next week. Um, but Christmas Carol, this is an unabridged version. So exciting. Obviously we will probably not read this all in one night. Um, we might, but it may take a couple days and that's okay with me. We can read you know, we can take a couple days and go through it because some of these others like this one, and this is a lot, this here, the sneaky snow fox, a lot of the Christmas ones I found were more like this, which it's super cute. I read the story. It's a really cute, really cute story. Um, I guess I just, I don't know there. I like stories, especially with children's books that have like this, I don't know, this like deep, or pull at your heart, I guess. And so this one was really cute and I went ahead and picked it up and it was only $1.99 at Poppers. Um, so I got that one. This one is a really cute, like quick read, but it's adorable and the artwork, that's another thing. The artwork in kids' books. I definitely swoon over certain books and the artwork inside of them. Um, this is called The Hat, a little picture book. It's, it's adorable. Let me see. Christmas Girl didn't have any artwork. And these, these are cute. You know, it's got some cute art inside. Just not my favorites. This book, oh my gosh. Okay, so I sat there in the children's section, like reading all of these books. This one is The Key Into Winter, and I paid $2.99 for this book. This book is beautiful. 
beautiful, beautiful inside, like with the artwork, but also the story. It is, it is just, it's just the sweetest, the sweetest story. I'm, I don't want to give a bunch of away, but you guys, if you like look this up on Amazon and read about it, I'm not a book, I'm not a booktuber or book review person. I just kind of share what I, what I'm reading um, and ones that I love. This was such a sweet story. So those are the four that I picked up. When I do my big wrapping, maybe I will film and do like a wrap my books with me and show you each one that I have collected for December. So fun. Um, yeah. Let me know if you guys like this type of video. Come into the store with me or come into the bookstore with me. Book hauls. Um, what I'm reading, all that kind of stuff. All right, until next time, enjoy your wild, sexy lives.